It's hope for those dealing with Alzheimer's. The FDA has just approved a new drug which could slow the progression of early symptoms. Yeah, some good news here for sure. A couple in Kensington says the drug is already helping them live better lives. Our chief political reporter Susan Raff is here right now to tell us more about this promising drug. Susan. Mark and Aaron, very promising for a lot of families, many of them here in Connecticut. This drug, which is called Donaneneb, was used in many clinical trials. And now the FDA has approved it. And for this one family, it is making a difference. Okay. All right, so let's bring them out here. Susan and Jim are setting up for their July 4th party. It's been a difficult few years for them. Back in 2020, they got some bad news. He just was having difficulty carrying on a conversation. Jim was diagnosed with Alzheimer's. You know, you feel really uh, helpless. You don't know what to do. During the pandemic, Jim couldn't get any treatment, which was extremely frustrating. But last year, he was part of a clinical trial for a new drug, Donaneneb. Last year, the FDA approved another drug, Lakembi. Both attack plaque in the brain, but differently. This new drug is a monoclonal antibody and is designed to slow the progression of the disease. This means this medication can give families more time together. It can potentially give them more time to live independently. Jim told Susan he wanted to do something to stop him from getting worse. Jim wanted, you wanted something done, right? You, you, you wanted. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. Jim lost a lot of speech at the beginning before taking the new drug. He doesn't speak much now, but Susan says they're able to do many things, like bowling, which they both enjoy doing together. Jim also was recently part of a walk. The blue flower he is holding means he is living with Alzheimer's. We're living life to the best of our ability and we still have him here. And every, you know, every month, every six months, every year we have him is great. This new promising drug is set to be available in just two weeks. It does cost quite a bit, $32,000 a year, but we are told it will be covered by Medicare and Medicaid. It is important to know the warning signs and see a doctor right away because the sooner you get treatment, the better chance you have of slowing down this devastating disease. Susan Raff, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. Well